What's happening, Tech Timers? This is Andre of Andre's Tech Time and Product Reviews, where I review cool tech and everyday products that will make your lives just a little bit easier. And today, I am coming to you live with no jive as I review a home security camera that may be just what you're looking for. It's the Real Link Argus Eco Plus Real Link Solar Panel. Can you dig it? Okay, so before I get down to the nitty gritty, please don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, and ring the bell all below. And please share if you care. Now, full disclosure, um, I purchased a couple of these security cameras and I've had them for a while. They've been sitting in my pile of products to be reviewed and they kind of got lost in the sauce. They've just been sitting there for a while. So the, obviously the boxes are open because I did take a look. So this is the real link. Um, Argus Eco plus the Real Link solar panel, uh, panel. And the reason why I purchased a couple of these is because I want to be able to, uh, I live in a desert, so I want to be able to keep an eye out on the wild animals. And um, that includes both the four-legged as well as the two-legged variety, if you catch my drift. So let's get started. This is the box. There's some information on this side and we're gonna go over all of this. Information on the back, side, bottom. Let's get everything out of the box. So envelope containing some documentation, camera, put that here. Get everything together. Last item. Whole bunch of stuff in this box. Okay, let's start with the camera itself. There it is, and we'll take a close look at that in just a moment. This is the mounting bracket for the solar panel. This connects to the camera. Mountain bracket for the camera. USB to charge up the camera when you first get it. A strap, if you want to strap the camera to something. Antenna for the camera. Mounting plate. There you go. And mounting hardware. Screws and such. Okay, so that's everything that comes in the box. Well, let's go ahead and take a look at the documentation. sticker that aids you with drilling the holes and in this we're going to have instruction manual quick start guide another sticker and another you know mounting template so that's everything that comes inside of the box let's go ahead and take a look at the specs and then we'll take a look at that camera Okay, Tech Timers, let's take a look at the specs. Power source, DC, rechargeable battery, solar panel. The resolution is 1080p, which is full HD. It has built-in CMOS image sensor. Field of view is 100 degrees. The range is 33 feet through 850 nanometer uh, infrared LED light. Wireless connection is 2.4G. Built-in motion det uh, detector. Smart PIR with instant alerts, so it pushes alerts to your app, email, has a built-in siren. You can also record your own voice alerts. Storage, SD card, up to 32 gigs, are, and that should say and, free seven-day rolling, uh, rolling cloud storage up to one gigabyte. 
Audio is two-way, weatherproof, IP65 certified. It runs on Android, iOS, Alexa, Google Assistant. There's also a website. It's made out of a tough ABS plastic. Okay, now that we've got this out of the way, let's get down to the get down and look this bad boy over. You dig? Okay, tech timer. So this is the camera. Front, rear, bottom and top. So this is going to be this little hole right there. That's the microphone. When the unit is turned off, uh, turned on, you will see a little red light and that will be your LED status light. That's the lens right here. That is the daylight sensor, motion detector right here. On the rear of the unit, that's the mounting hole. Antenna goes there. This is the charging port. I've got a little F there because this is going to be the front camera. Of course, the other camera will have an R for rear. That's your charging port. So as soon as you get it, use the USB cable connected to a wall outlet, charge it up. And then when you're ready to mount it, that's where the uh, solar panel is going to connect. This is the bottom of the unit. That little pinhole, reset. That's on and off for power. And that's your SD card slot. I've got a card in there already, 32 gigs. This is your speaker. And you use this to add and set it up. So go ahead and download the app from the Android uh, Play Store, or you can download it from Apple. It's the Real Link app. And when it comes up, it says Devices, and Add. I'm gonna click on Add. I'm gonna show you how easy this is to add. So when you download it, don't forget to set up an account. Let's make sure that I get this just right. It says adding device. Okay, so now it's added and what I'll need to do is set, set it up so that the camera is on the same network as my Wi-Fi. So let me go ahead and get this set up and then I'll show you how it works. Cool. Okay, take timer, so let's go ahead and take a look. I've got the camera pointed at some items on my desk. That's what it's looking at right now. So let's zoom in a little bit. It's on devices. If I go into settings, that's what I call it, front cam. Battery is 100%, it's on my home network. If I go into display, you'll see what it's pointed at. And if I put my hand in front of the camera, you can see there's my hand. Quality, I've got it set at 1080p. Anti-flicker, day and night, I have it set for color, so it's always going to record in color. The camera name is at the bottom right. Date is at the top center. There's a watermark, there's a privacy mask. And what that does is the privacy mask will allow you to block out anything that you don't want to record like the neighbor's house or whatever. So let me get out of that. And I'm gonna go back. So we were in display, the motion sensor is on. And what happens is the camera of course stops recording. It turns off when it picks up uh, a movement, then it's going to turn on. Camera recording, of course, is on. Push notifications, that's turned on because I wanna be alerted. Email alerts, I have turned off. Siren right now is turned off, but if I turn that on, right now it's on siren. Let's go back. I'm going to go into, into display. I'm gonna put my hand in front of the camera and let's see what happens. There's the alarm. Okay. So now, let's go back. I'm gonna turn the siren off. 
And of course, notice that there was custom alarm sound. If I wanted to uh, create my own alarm, that's where I would do it. So let's get out of that. Go back. Oops. Share the camera. So right now I've got it on the app installed on this phone. I can share it to my wife's phone as well. Record audio, etc. Change password, date and time. I have it record audio so that what so that the camera will pick up sounds and it will record. Infrared lights, I have it on auto, so therefore when it picks up something, it's gonna turn on. And then when it's done, it's gonna shut off. I can reboot the camera, I can restore the camera. If I restore the camera, it wipes out the SD card. And of course, I can delete the camera. Now, when I set up the rear camera, that will be below. Cloud, you have your cloud storage so that not only will the, um, the information be stored on the SD card, but it will also be uh, uploaded to the cloud and you can view that from your computer. Also, you can control your security cameras through smart home. That's pretty much it. And um, I'm gonna go ahead and and it should reconnect. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, wrap this up. Okay, Tech Timers, I just wanted to give you all a quick look at how everything looks when it's all set up. Camera, antenna, mount, solar panel, solar power mount, charging cable connected to the camera. Mount this up on the roof, get sunlight, charges up the camera. Camera shuts off until it detects motion, then it begins recording. Now, I don't remember exactly what I said about the, uh, the red light um, earlier, but I was going over the instructions, so let me explain something to you. If you see a red light, a red LED, then it's not connected to your network. If you see the blue LED like you see now, then it's connected to your network. So I think right now, y'all know what time it is. It's time for Andre's Tech Time and Product Reviews Rating System. If I like the product I'm reviewing, right on. If I don't like it, right off. If I really like it, groovy, man. And if I really don't like it, it's gonna be a jive turkey. I'm gonna give this a groovy, man. And I'll tell you why. Because I think it works the way it's supposed to. It's built very well. This is just like, this is, uh, you know, as good a quality as other solar panels I have on my house for some solar lights. And um, it works, I, I just think it works very well. Very easy to set up. It just took a few minutes to set up. I, I, like I said, I had these for, you know, quite a while now. And I don't remember exactly what I paid for them, maybe 35, 40 bucks each. Um, but y'all can double check that on Amazon. But anyway, that concludes my review of the Argus, of the Real Link Argus Eco security camera. Thank you for hanging out here with me on Andre's Tech Time and Product Reviews. Please keep in mind that with all of my reviews, all of the opinions expressed are my own. I don't get paid to do this, and I purchase all of the products with my own money. Enough said. Keep on trucking, and I will catch you on the flip side in my next video. Can you dig it?